Welcome to the other side of Hollywood. Diving into the successful career of a Hollywood icon who graced our silver screens for over six decades, we find ourselves in awe in Jack Nicholson's timeless contributions to cinema. It's been 14 years since Nicholson had last graced the silver screen, yet his legacy boasts nearly 80 total acting credits. From unforgettable performances in The Departed, The Shining, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, Chinatown, As Good As It Gets, and many more. Nicholson's versatility and depth as an actor had left an enduring mark on the industry. During Nicholson's rise to fame, he encountered an unexpected rival in the form of Marlon Brando, the epitome of Hollywood stardom. It was Nicholson who emerged as the most decorated, becoming one of three male actors to clinch three Academy Awards, surpassing even Brando, who had won two Academy Awards. Despite being from different eras, Brando perceived the budding Nicholson as a threat to his reign. However, as Brando became to recognize Nicholson's wild antics, it then seemed tensions eased. Nicholson was modest in claiming that they were friends, but they were neighbors for several decades. Their unique dynamic had paved the way for lasting mutual admiration, which endured even after Brando's passing in 2004. Afterward, Jack Nicholson felt a profound sense of responsibility when he acquired Brando's property with the noble intention of passing it on to Brando's heirs. However, despite his best intentions, Nicholson was met with disinterest from Brando's 11 plus children. Undeterred by the setback, Nicholson decided to demolish the neglected estate, ultimately transforming it into a vibrant garden in 2006 as a heartfelt tribute to Brando's memory. Looks like their stories were just as compelling in real life as their performances were on the screen. For now, Jack Nicholson has not yet officially retired, but he is enjoying a quiet life, doing whatever he wants to do. And that's it for The Other Side of Hollywood.